This is CHS TV News. Good morning, Cathedral. I'm Rachel. And I'm Emma with your morning announcements for Wednesday, October 5th. To start off our show, I'll pass it over to Kyle, who has your weekly Council Corner update. Good morning, Gales. Student Council is happy to report that orders for our first fall spirit work collection have been spectacular so far. We thank you for your orders and we look forward to filling them. Remember, we are always open to your feedback, your thoughts, and suggestions, so don't be afraid to approach a council member with any of your concerns. A reminder that Spiritware orders forms, along with your money, are due today. You must have submitted your form and money by the end of the day today. This is your last chance to place an order for a while, so take advantage of, to, so take advantage of it while you can. Note that there are Spiritware days coming soon, and you'll definitely want to have some fresh sporting gear during our homecoming week festivities later this month. As you heard in our prayer, today we celebrate World Teachers Day. This is the day to take some time to appreciate all the incredible work that our teachers do on a daily basis so we the students may succeed. Our teachers have been and continue to be mentors. They are beacons of light in darkness. They inspire us, they motivate us, and they show us the tools we need to be successful. Here at Cathedral, we are blessed to have a phenomenal group of educators who strive for excellence in this community. Our teachers not only fortify our educations in the classroom, but outside as well. Our amazing extracurriculars would not be possible if it were not for our dedicated and passionate teachers. So on behalf of Student Council and the entire Cathedral student body, I'd like to wish each and every teacher a very happy World Teachers Day. Thank you so much for all your hard work and vital contributions to this community. We are eternally grateful. Thanks for listening, and I will toss it back to your anchors. Thanks, Kyle. The Academic Achievement Awards evening will take place Wednesday, October 19th at 7 p.m. Invitations will be distributed this week and require an immediate reply. Please bring the response card either to Mrs. Tabone or Mrs. Van Veen in rooms 325 and 326 or to the main office. Also, please check that your name has been included on the honor roll recipient list posted outside of the guidance office. Pilgrimage permission forms and pledge forms can now be picked up in the cafeteria during your lunch periods. You must bring back a signed permission form before you can pick up a pledge form. You will want your pledge form for this weekend, a long weekend with family to get your $25 in pledges to help our brothers and sisters in Haiti, to the Dominican Republic, and Uganda. The pilgrimage walk takes place on Sunday, October 16th. The Cathedral Arts Department is organizing a four-day, three-night trip to Chicago. If you are enrolled in a music, art, or drama course this year or are a part of an art extracurricular group, you are eligible to sign up for this trip. Please see Mr. Walker as soon as possible to get your name on the list. There are only 40 spots available, so the first 40 people to sign up and bring in their non-refundable deposits are guaranteed a spot on the trip. There will be a Chackers Club meeting today after school in room 308. Also, the stage crew will be meeting right after school in room 109. Any students interested in joining the stage crew are invited to attend. Also after school, the Gale Pride Group will be meeting in room 301. Thanks from the advisors. And tomorrow, the yearbook committee will be meeting in room 314. All members must attend. For all students who want to work out in our fitness center, the supervision schedule is posted on the fitness center door. Remember, a fitness membership is required that costs only $15 a semester. For further details regarding permission forms and orientation, please see Mr. Muley. The Cathedral Boys baseball team was back in action yesterday and battled hard but fell short 10-1 to to the first place St. Mary's Crusaders. The boys play next on Thursday versus the St. Thomas More Knights in their final league game. Are you interested in playing on the senior boys basketball team? If so, there will be a tryout tonight at 6.30 p.m. If you are unable to attend but would still like to try out, please speak with Mr. Mega. If you missed the swim team meeting and want to be on the team, drop by the co-op office and student services and get sometime this week and get a parent permission form. Thanks from Coach Lucier. Good morning, Cathedral, and happy World Teachers Day. This morning's prayer and our president's address regarding World Teachers Day speak volumes of the contributions of our own teachers here at Cathedral. And so uh, my words will pale in comparison to that of Kyle's this morning as he celebrates the contributions of our Cathedral teaching staff. And so I would like to express our appreciation on behalf of the administration here at the school to all teachers at Cathedral, both present and past, for their contributions. 
I want to tell everyone that World Teachers Day has been celebrated every October 5th since 1994. And as according to UNESCO, World Teachers Day recognizes, appreciates, and understands the vital role that teachers play in the development of education and educational programs worldwide. So on behalf of everyone here, we'd like to wish all teachers good health, long life, and all worldly happiness. Have a great Cathedral Day. Back to the desk. Thanks, sir. And those are all of your announcements for today, Cathedral. Have a great day, Gales, and thanks for watching.